after a driver crashes into a water line. CBS 13's Elisa Bassetta joins us live from the scene with the details. What can you tell us now, Elisa? Good morning. Yeah, they just moments ago opened uh, this lane here, which was closed off because of that uh, accident with the water main. I want to show you just right here. You see this kind of dent or the, the wood sheared off of this power pole. Here's a piece of the vehicle that was involved in this crash, but apparently it was traveling southbound here on 65th, hit this pole for some unknown reason, bounced off, and then wedged itself between that far pole on the corner and a water main. We're told a four inch water main that broke. Water was spewing everywhere. There were three people inside that vehicle, including the driver. A witness said after he heard the noise, he ran over there. Here's what that witness had to say He was pinned in. I couldn't get him out. So I busted the window. And, you know, he started taking everybody out. And then they said there was gas leak. So we were yanking on the door and it was just bent car. in. And he was stuck. He wasn't going nowhere. She was unconscious. And she wasn't coming out either. Firefighters had to extricate those people uh, with the jaws of life. They were taken out of the roof of that car. It was a RAV4. They were all taken to the hospital. It appeared they have minor injuries, but they're still being checked out. And obviously, this is still under investigation as to what caused them to lose control in the first place. But again, this happened uh, about a quarter to four this morning. Uh, just moments ago, uh, Utility Air was able to get that water stopped because that water was pumping out for quite some time. The water receded, and they were able to open uh, this lane here on 65th. Back to you. Alyssa Bassetta with the details on that uh, water main that was hit, that water line hit there on 65th and Broadway in that crash. Alyssa, thank you. Time now, 6.20.